Hello everyone, it's your girl Monique Seta and my message of today is directed towards the African men or African ladies or women, whatever way you want to put it or say it. When we go out for like African meetings or gathering or whatever you want to call it, we go out to have fun, you know, meet new faces and learn other cultures. For example, let me say you meet a sister or a brother coming from Nigeria, Cameroon, whatever, you know, you basically learn a lot about other cultures and just have fun at your meeting or gathering or whatever and discuss about what you can do to better life back home. There's nothing wrong with a single sister or a single brother hooking up at one of the African gatherings. You know, I don't see anything wrong with that. But I see something wrong when you have uh, a married brother or a married sister, let me use the word happily married brother or happily married sister trying to hook up together, then there is a problem with that. You know, sometimes this, let me use the word these African men or our African men, you are happily married. Let me use the word happily married, whether happily or not happily married, but you see a sister or a young woman sister or whatever trying to grow up or uh, happily married and you approach that sister trying to have an affair with that sister and if that sister says no it becomes a big deal that is crazy and you sit and call that person your sister or your brother and from the same country with this sister with this brother and you are trying to be that agent of destruction. Instead of trying to destroy that sister, why can't you, like, I don't know, advise that sister, let me use the word happily married sister, encourage her to build up her relationship of, you know, instead of trying to destroy that relationship by trying to have an affair with that sister that is really really bad if you are such brother you know you don't deserve to see sisters like that outside and call them my sister you know because they are not your sisters if they are your sisters you will be out there looking for their interest instead of trying to destroy their life you know you are an agent of destruction and that is very very bad you know i'm just saying i don't want any sister out there to fall an escape go or to be an escape go to men like this because at the end of the day these are african men we're talking about at the end of the day they're going to rush back home to their wives and kids or whatever and you're going to be left, you that sister is going to be left with a broken home. You know, we just got to be careful. It's a crazy world out there, you know. Just watch out and, you know, know when or who you can call a brother or who you can call a sister. Be very, very careful. Like I said, it's a crazy world out there anybody that any lady that has ears should hear if you're that lady that don't, don't want to listen at the end of the day you're the one that's gonna be to blame be careful but um uh, thank you so much i hope this um helps you somehow some way and enjoy the rest of the week. Thank you.